Look who stayed home today. Yesterday he had a 101 fever. I decided just to keep him home today. Oh man, this guy's lucky. We ordered some main chick today. There was a code for 25 bucks off, so we ordered it. How are you feeling, buddy? Good. Now that you got some food in you, you feeling a little better? How's the food? Good. All I've eaten today is three fries. Mm -hmm. Just right now is your first meal of the day. It's like 12.30 already. Basically brunch for mm. me. Just wash some more sweet peas for the kids. Surprisingly, they prefer to eat them raw. Sometimes I eat it raw, but sometimes I just like saute it or boil it like barely. Just for a few minutes and I leave it a little bit crunchy. Your ear hurts? Oh, that's not good. He's a little bit under the weather, but today's the first day for his soccer practice, and we've been a little bit iffy on whether or not he should go today. Look at this ginormous one, guys. <laughs> okay, let me just give these to the kids. Here, boys, have a snack. Yay! Want it? You don't feel good? Here, PJ. Baba. Maybe it'll make you feel better. All right, dinner time, One. guys. One shall speak the truth. You guys are practicing. Keep a promise. Keep a promise. Power's helping them remember and recite their karate oath because they have a test tomorrow. So today we have chicken rice. I bought a bunch of chicken from the market and that is what we're going to eat today. Oh, I forgot to cut the chicken. I think it should be fine. Let me wash the rice and then we pretty much decided we're not going to do soccer today. Just let Uriah rest. We don't want to push him too much because he's just a little bit okay, under one. the weather. First one is true. Look keep at it. Okay, stop. One. One shot. Keep a trail. Keep. Keep a trail. Keep a trail. Keep. Keep a trail. Keep a trail. No, you had you had it right. So once I'll keep once I'll speak the truth, one then keep. Keep a promise. Keep keep a promise. Remain. 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 I got it. Remain faithful. Remain faithful. One. One child speak. Speak. speak the truth, keep a promise, and remain faithful. Okay, again. One child keep a promise. No, it's not promise first. One child speak the truth, keep a promise, and... and <laughs> Power is so smart. He recorded the motto and the oath, and Uriah is just playing it on repeat over and over and over. I mean, Uriah is six years old. It's harder for him to memorize things. So that'll be fine. But I don't think the teacher, the sensei, is going to be too hard on them because um, last session, pretty much all the white belts graduated to yellow. So if you're a white belt going into yellow, she's not as hard on you. As long as you know some of the stuff, you don't need to know it perfectly. Um, she will pass you to yellow belt. So hopefully tomorrow um, the boys will make it to yellow belt. Um... So I don't know what I was saying earlier, if you guys even heard me, but I'm trying to get dinner going today. So today and tomorrow, I have to figure out dinner because with the kids' activities, it gets really busy, especially Tuesdays and Wednesdays when I'm in the office. So I'm trying to like plan ahead. So today I'm making chicken rice. So there's a bunch of chicken. I'm going to do the ginger um, and scallion right now and the rice. 
And then I'm also going to be baking or broiling some chicken thighs, some seasoned chicken thighs. And I'm going to make um, their favorite bow tie pasta. And I'm just going to like leave it in the fridge so then power can just warm it up for the kids tomorrow. I was actually thinking about maybe working from home tomorrow because Uriah's not feeling well. I'm not, I'm, I'm a little iffy about that, but let me just prepare as if I'm not gonna be home, just in case. I present to you the chicken rice. This is the rice. This is all the chicken that I took out. I'm gonna cut them into smaller pieces for the kids. These are the sauces and yeah. That's dinner. Uriah is feeling okay. He's feeling better. Um, I did give him a little bit of Tylenol. He was complaining his ear hurt earlier. Um, PJ's in the bathtub. I feel like ever since we decided we weren't going to go to soccer, we've just been like taking our sweet time, laying around, resting. So <laughs> it's kind of getting late now. But I guess because of the time change, it doesn't feel late. Because it still feels like 5 something, but it's not. It's actually 6.30 right now. Alright, so let me just give Uriah his food first. Alright, Uriah's dinner. I told him to come get it. Uh, PJ's not done, so I think I'm just going to eat first then. Oh, Uriah's so sweet. He took one look at it. He goes, oh, I love this type of chicken. That's nice. I was a little afraid he was... Or the boys are like a little bit tired of it because I do make it quite often. It's kind of like one of my go-to meals because it's easy, it's quick, relatively like a one-pot type of meal, you know? Okay. Okay. Mmm. So tasty. What do you think, Uriah? Is it good? Yeah. I just tried to bake it up. Mmm. That's all I tried. Okay. If you want more, there's more. You guys probably having some too. I thought the cereal was your dinner. It was, but. Uh, <laughs> I, I like don't feel good at all. So you should definitely eat something. That's my motto. If you don't feel good, I feel like you should just eat. Even if you don't feel like eating, just eat because your body needs it, you know? That's it? I would I would put more. <laughs>